hello, hello. What's up, everyone? Welcome back. Hope you're all doing well. If you're in the Northern Hemisphere, um, in Canada, such as I, it's beginning to get cold, which is great, which is just fine, because I, I just embrace it. I love it. I'll just sit in the freezing cold because, hey, it's good. I like it, right? We're, we're animals. We're built to endure the seasons. We're built to embrace change and discomfort. That's what we do. It's awesome. You just breathe into it like Wim Hof. Go check out the Wim Hof method. He's just breathing and like focusing and embracing like freezing cold temperatures and he just does it. He's running up and down mountains in his underwear. You can do it. All right. So that's what's up. Um, has anyone been doing meditation lately? I have. I've been doing it. I've been doing one hour a day. Like some kind of damn fucking monk in a mountain somewhere. But you know what? I'm not a monk in a mountain. I'm a human being who's just getting it going. Who has a fucking beard and man bun. Okay? You can do it too. You don't need anyone else to tell you how to do it. You can just get started. So I recommend you do it. Okay? In fact, today, today is your lucky day. I am now entering a new phase of professionalism here on the YouTube slash Instagram. Check it out. I went to a like conference, like a book writing, like kind of like marketing conference, you know, and I've learned about all kinds of fantastic fucking clickbait titles and stuff to use. <laughs> I'm going to try to put some in there just for a laugh here. I have a whole list, so maybe I'll try to put them on there. Full disclosure. So when you see clickbait titles, you're gonna be like, holy fuck, Luke's getting smart. He must be listening to Gary Vee, <laughs> who's cool. I love Gary Vee, by the way. Okay, so check it out. So this was part of the program, was you like write down these like, you know how there's always these videos where it's like, the 10 magical ways to fucking improve your life. <laughs> hey man, this is how the fucking world works, okay? So check it out. This was my practice one. It was like, so I chose like the topic of meditation, okay? Because that's what I've been talking about lately. So I just chose it and then I just wrote some shit down. So these are, these are, <laughs> the, <laughs> these are the fucking, um, these are the 10, the 10 benefits, the 10 secret benefits that the fucking Illuminati doesn't want you to know about meditating. The 10 ways that meditation can benefit you, that the fucking Illuminati is keeping from you. Those fuckers. So check it out. So I'm just going to get this started, you know, and then over time, maybe it will learn and learn and turn into something more valuable, a book perhaps, who knows. And I can be a professional online influencer. I can be a professional um, uh, fucking digital nomad. <laughs> That's my dream. Um, okay. So check it out. Why the fuck should you start meditating immediately? Other than you have no fucking choice, which is really all you need to know. But I'll play the game a little bit. So, um, okay, so here we go. It, gr it, um, all right, how the fuck did I do this? Okay, so yeah, this is what I did. This is what I did. I, okay, I, all right, it's a little bit sloppy. I'm still working on it. Bear with me. Anyway, here, here are ten ways so you can start meditating <laughs> reasons to start meditating okay it helps you deal with your memories right you've got memories deep like impacted inside your fucking mind and like inside your your body and shit One second. <sighs> inside your body and shit and if you can start to meditate it's going to help you unravel those thoughts those memories and shit okay so that's one. So also uncovering thoughts, 
not only do you have like memories and shit in there, but you also have like reoccurring thought patterns that are in there as well. And so you also have to like break that shit down. Meditation again is going to help you with that. <laughs> Hope this is working for you guys. Um, it's a way to invest in yourself. Okay. You always want to be investing in yourself. And this is like a simple way to do it. Like as soon as you start meditating regularly, it's like, you know, you're investing in yourself. So you can literally just start telling people that you're like, I invest in myself. I'm a fucking person who invests in myself. All right. So not only does it help you sort through your, your fucking thoughts, sort out your memories and shit. It also helps you deal with sort through your feelings right? Like your, your fucking, your feelings, that shit is all again, like you don't even, this is especially for guys, but also for girls, like in two different ways, like for guys, like we can't even distinguish between like one feeling or another. Like we have basically like no ability, like almost none. It's like almost zero ability to distinguish between one feeling and another. You're just like, you just like sitting there and you're just like, um, I don't know. Like, cause you can't even tell. And for mostly what happens is we just get so like, they're just all become like uncomfortable to us. We just feel always uncomfortable with feelings and we just ignore them. All this shit's not good, man. It's not going to work for the girls. You probably are just like out of control of your feelings it's just like oh i feel this way oh i feel that way oh i feel this way you don't have any impact on them right so you want to be able to sort through those you want to more highly tune like your mechanism to in be intuitive towards those feelings right and for the girl you want to be able to better control them so either way you want to fucking sort that out man meditation get the fuck in there and do it okay Oh, here's, here's, here's a good one. Okay. Here's a good one. This is, this is tip. This is a tip here. Um, you become more attractive. Seriously. Like meditation is the most player shit you can fucking do. Like this is gangster player fucking pimp baller shit. It really is, man you like you're going to become more attractive if you start meditating i know it i know it's hard to believe i know it is i i get it it's hard to understand it's hard to believe that that will happen but it will if you're the guy you're going to be more centered you're going to be more filled with strength you're going to be more understanding of yourself that's baller shit and that's like the next step in this like little, little like little book I'm filling out here. I'm going to go more into detail. So I think that the videos will actually get better over time. I think they're going to start getting better <laughs> once I, once it, you know, once I catch on a little bit. Okay. So become more attractive for the girls. You're going to be more, you won't be like floating all over the place so much. You won't be like bouncing around so much. You, you'll be a better center too. It's just more attractive, man. Meditation equals more attractiveness. Boom. Get in there. Okay. You're going to be able to find meaning in your life. I don't know what we're on. I think six or seven maybe now. Find meaning in your life. You're going to be able to actually understand the fucking purpose of your existence. It will be like you'll, you'll realize the whole the whole meaning of it all, you know, if there is any meaning, is that you're doing this process. You're existing and you're you're becoming aware of your feelings, these processes, these thoughts. You're working at this. And that, like, is the whole reason. It's like you see little ants scurrying around and collecting, like, cookie crumbs. That's what they're doing, man. I don't know. They're just collecting cookie crumbs and taking it back to the queen. Your purpose is to, like, invest in yourself and meditate through these issues and things will come out of that. You'll feel inspired, right, from that. You will. I fucking promise you, you will. You'll feel inspired to fucking draw a picture, paint a painting. You will not feel like it's all hopeless. You won't. Even though it might feel 
even though it might feel like less, like you might feel less, like, I don't know, you'll, you'll be more like, I don't really, let's get that out of the way. You, you might not feel like immediately, you know, exactly what the purpose is, but you'll feel much more like, okay with that. You'd be like, I'm cool with this. So you'll be able to find meaning. Okay. It's good shit. Oh, fuck. Here's a good one. Here's a good one. These might get revised over time. I, do you know what I feel like? I feel like I'm um, doing a school project that, like, I wasn't, I didn't, like, do it properly. Like, I wasn't, I wasn't properly prepared. <laughs> it's like I showed up to class one morning and the teacher's like, oh, Luke, you have a, uh, to do a book report. And I'm like, fucking Bart Simpson. And I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, here's the book. <laughs> and I'm just winging it. Oh my, how things just, some things just take a long time to change, you know, but hey, I'm on the journey and I'm learning and I'm getting better. And this is all part of the fun. This is what makes it, this is what makes it special and cool and relatable. This is my relatability. This is my added value. I'm the everyman. You can relate. <laughs> okay. Grounding your fucking energy. Ground that shit right? You need to be fucking grounded. Like that's some hardcore player shit. Grounding. <sighs> like not being blown around like a leaf, man. Like getting in touch with the fucking planets and the moons and the stars and the earth and the trees and the fucking antelope and the, the, the wind patterns and the human heart and the human fucking existence. You want to get in contact with that hardcore. That's where you want to be. That's you becoming grounded to the universe, to the earth too, but to greater things as well. Grounded dudes are cool. Grounded chicks are fun to hang out with. That's what you want to be. How do you do it? Meditate, motherfucker. <laughs> if we, yeah, that'll be a hashtag. Hashtag meditate, motherfucker. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here's another one. This must be like eight or nine. I think I skipped a few too because now that I look at them, I didn't like them as much. <laughs> oh, I love it so much. I love making these vids. They're so much fun. They make me laugh, okay? And that's what life's all about. It's good for a laugh. Here we go. Growing your confidence. Growing your confidence. Your confidence. Okay? Like, ah, here I am. Existing. That's enough, man. That's enough. I'm happy here to exist. To be alive. To fucking grow. To just experience what what is let life wash over me like a fucking river that's gonna grow your confidence man because you're gonna be comfortable with what you're doing you know you're doing the right thing you don't have to be worried all the time you don't have to be like wondering like what should i do i'm just a leaf in the wind oh my god no one cares about that person it's like you t i made so many videos that are brutal as fuck where i'm just like cussing at the individual watching it's like, if you need some more of that, go just go pick any other video and you'll probably get that, right? So I'm not going to hammer that home right now, but it's like, dude, you don't want to be a leaf in the wind. You don't want to be just like some fucking weak loser because the reality is nobody cares about that. You don't get a fucking medal. You don't get like special time. It just doesn't work that way. But if you get in touch with these ideas, you can grow this stuff. You can grow your actual confidence. And people will like you more and it will get better and stronger over time. The girls will like you. The dudes will want to hang out with you. How do you get there? Tell me. You, someone here, say it. Say it as you're watching. Just say the words out loud. Starts with an M. <laughs> it's meditate, motherfucker. Get up on it. Okay. Um, then I had one um, like that was like, how to start meditating that was actually the first one that i skipped because i don't know if i was gonna do these or not but i think actually it's still a good one okay <laughs> if 
probably should have started with that one. One of the one of the ideas was to put these in order. But right, so thought for later for Luke, learn to follow instructions. <laughs> um how to start, man. I think I've made shitloads of videos about that. You know how to start, because I've fucking said it many times. You just decide, first of all. You just accept. You listen to the video here on 10, way, 10 reasons to meditate. You go, oh, okay, I have to start. Good. Then what do you do? You start small, man. I used to say, I used to say, do the three minutes for three times a week. For three months that is a good thing but now i'm even kind of moving up past that and i'm just saying like let's just get started like even let's just get started like you go on youtube go on my my youtube and look at my me just go to the meditation playlist and there's like 30 or 40 meditation videos all of which i've used so i've used them personally so you can choose any one of those and i've used them okay and then you just put it for the time that you want. Like if you want 10 minutes and just put the thing to the end and save 10 minutes. So you, if it's like an hour thing, you go 15 minutes in. And then you just like lay back and cover your eyes. And put your headphones in. Now you're meditating. You should do it. That's a reason. <laughs> reason to start meditating okay now the last one this will be the 10th one um the 10th reason to actually start <laughs> meditating uh because it's practical it's practical it's practical you can do it want to know why it's practical because you as i just said in the first one how to start you have all those items already you have a computer or a fucking iphone or whatever you're watching this on you know you have phone <laughs> headphones because they came with the fucking phone you just take your shirt off and cover your eyes and then just lay back wherever you are. Preferably like at home or something. You just lay back or sit back, whatever you want. And then you want the little like practical, very practicalities of literally how it's done. Maybe I'll make like a whole nother video another time about this and go in detail. But basically, you just breathe. Notice that the breath just kind of comes of itself, right? It's coming, it's happening, you're alive. And as you're breathing like that, also some thought patterns come in. You keep breathing. Oh, interesting, a thought pattern. Hmm. You can even notice like a judgment that comes off that like, wow, those thought patterns are fucked up. Because they might be shit about like, hey, Luke, you're fucking never going to make money. You suck. Da, da, da. Wow, that's fucked up. Most of them are negative, by the way, just so you know. They come in. But others, over time, you start to grow past that. Actually, a lot of times I've grown past that now. And I'm just like, oh, wow, this is cool. And it's valuable to even access, like, why are they like that? Or maybe they're good ones sometimes. They're like, wow, you're really fucking balling out at this. I'm like, oh, that's cool. That's a reaction. You just keep doing that, and that just keeps happening. And you grow it like a muscle. It's like when you go to the gym, you start doing push-ups. At first, it's hard, but over time, your muscles get stronger. You get better. That's how it works. Okay? So there you go. That was... That was my first... That was my first try at, like, a... A, like, following a template for a video. I think I did okay. I think I did, like, about a 7.5 out of 10. Something like that. So that's not bad. Maybe the next one will be a little better. I think so. But you know what? Even if it's not, that's cool too. Because I think that's what's fun about it. But I'm also not attached to being too, too attached to being the like video that isn't super professional. I'm open to it to becoming better. Because you see, we always want to remain open to improving our program, to investing in more valuable ideas. Because they will come, right? Staying stagnant is not a productive model for us as the advancing human being. We're, we're constantly on the path of advancement. We can take joy and, you know, appreciation in that journey of expansion and growth, 
knowing that it is our fundamental purpose, right? Our fundamental purpose is to grow and expand and learn. And, and part of that is that it's a challenging journey. You see, it is a challenging journey. But we, as creatures on this earth, that is kind of what we're doing. We're involved in this like strenuous, as uh, Teddy Roosevelt said, the strenuous life. We're, <coughs> excuse me, we're involved in that. And we must accept that. But there are, so there are certain truths that you must accept. But that's okay, right? We, in doing so, you access strength. When strength is what we want, strength, power, acceptance, appreciation, these are powerful, cool, strong, player fucking shit ways to look at life. This is some Zen, right? This is enlightenment. This is fucking spirituality. This is all that stuff. This is it in the 21st century, and this is how I want to do it. So this is what I'm doing. And I have the right to do that, and so do you. You know what I'm saying? Cool. All right, all right. So there you go. There's a nice little vid. Thank you for everyone checking this out. If any of you guys have like an added little reason to start meditating, why don't you just slide it in the comments? Just fucking slip it in there. Be like, hey, Luke, I have an idea too. Boom. Check it out. Chuck it in there. Cool. Okay. That's all for now. Hopefully, everyone is going to have a good day. And as always, peace out.